Hello again. This segment is going to be about boosting. Why should you boost? Well, for no other reason, you need it to graduate. At least a dollar investment will let you graduate. Another reason would be it's another alternative way of uh, making money on Fanbox. When should you invest? Well, you can invest at any time, but I tend to invest more like, say, my, I got extra money at the end of the month that wasn't funded by ads, and I want to boost my earnings for that month. That's a good time to do it also. So let's get started. Go on a new portfolio. Portfolio name. How much do you want to boost? The minimum is a dollar. The maximum is a hundred thousand. So we'll just start with a dollar. Now, you got how much do you want in return? You can either have Fanbox control this, which is what I suggest, or you could do a minimum return requirement. Like say you invest a dollar you want two dollars in return you want a two hundred percent profit chances are that's not going to happen so it'll sit your portfolio will sit and say uh, pending so to keep it from saying pending all the time um, I would suggest uh, just having fanbox control this continuing on who or what do you want to boost? Now you can do the simple, I want Fanbox to choose, or you can do advanced. I want to choose. Now here, you can automatically reboost returns from this portfolio using the same settings. I don't suggest doing that because uh, the return you'll get will be like three months down the road, and by that time you have forgotten, and you don't want the, hey, where'd my money go? So I uncheck that. Now, you have two areas. You have people and you have knowledge. We'll look at people first. Now, you can literally invest in anyone and whatever knowledge work that they're working on or no knowledge work at all. Like say I select Zoe, just Jeff, and Jenny Lee and select no knowledge areas this means I am totally funding them and all their ads that they're doing. Or you can, like I said, you can select knowledge areas that you want to fund that they work on. I like selecting people just because. Or you can do knowledge areas. Now I haven't really done this myself, but um, you can pick your own favorite knowledge areas or what's really popular or you can input your own pretty cool and then down here you got a, a box that's automatically checked for you to maximize utilization of your profile <clears throat> if your selections are too limited I leave that checked now you see that we got three people that we're going to be uh, funding over here so continue now you pick how you're gonna fund it now I don't have enough cash in my bank to fund it so I'm gonna exit out this is the cool part even though I can't fund it right now it's all set up it just incomplete so whenever you wanna go back in and complete it click on that again and there you go same thing then you can complete it then you submit and it goes through the final stages. Um, that's pretty much it for uh, boosting. Hope you enjoyed it and learned a lot. And I'll be moving on to the next section.